It's happening, folks. A week ago, True Love and I came to Ikea and did this. Some good old research at Ikea for the shed, the lighting. Let's go down to the lights. You guys are making this happen. Decisions, decisions, decisions. So many lights. Ikea is really big. Holy smokes. Wow. It's always a workout when you go in there. Okay. Basically, it's happening. We are working on the shed. Your clicks and your views of this vlog are enabling us to have a little bit of extra money to go buy lights, to go buy power strips, which Ikea did not have. So I got to zip off to maybe Lowe's or Home Depot or Ace. I don't know. But all, on, all I'm saying is it's happening. Thank you for supporting and for coming back and you're enabling us, your views, your clicks, are enabling us to purchase things for the shed. Okay, let's go, come on, gotta go get some more stuff. Particular are great for that. Saving it for New Year's Eve, saving it. So hard, so hard. All right, things are cleared out. I've got to go film tonight, so i got to go change real quick. Uh, I'll be back tonight to finish this and make some improvements and talk about the clicks. The clicks. Thank you for clicking. Thank you for clicking. On my way to filming for this evening and was on my way into Best Buy, but got a phone call from True Love, and basically they are on their way to the hospital because poor little Seth needs stitches. Oh man, this is life. This happens, especially with little boys. I don't, I don't know all the details, but anyway, we're gonna divert from buying the power strip tonight. Um, everything is okay. I don't need to go to the hospital, but basically, he needs stitches. So you know, this is, this is, this, this happens. All right. <sighs> See you at, well, probably the shed. And we're back home. It's approaching 11 p.m., so I'm gonna keep this as concise as possible. Uh, got done with filming and got back home, got the vacuum. Oh, checked on Seth, Seth is good. He, he's gonna be okay, he's gonna be okay. Just a good old four-year-old boy gash in the top of his foot. I'll update you tomorrow on that, I'll update you tomorrow on that. I'm in the shed, and why am I working on the shed? I'm trying to transform the space that we have which is not a ton, but it's something, right? It's something. I'm trying to transform this space into a tool for the vlog for you, to bring you more value, what I'm calling the studio shed, and it's coming along. However, I cleaned it out about a month ago, and sure enough, like over the last month, things have started to accumulate back in the shed, and so this afternoon I've been clearing things out and clearing things out and cleaning it up, and this evening, once I got back from filming, got that good old vacuum because this is no longer a shed, this is a studio, which means it needs to be clean for you so that I can record in here for you on a regular basis. But, but, the 2018 Demore family budget did not include 
redesigning a shed into a studio did not include buying lighting, good lighting, to light up this shed in a, in a, in a effective way to present to you beauty through videos and through presentations for you on YouTube. So, we did not have saved at the beginning of 2018 about what I predict to be eh, two to three hundred dollars to paint this wall, put a backdrop up, buy lights, buy a power cord, power strip, which I did not get today. We just didn't have it in the budget. So, that's where you come in. That's where you come in, YouTube. It's happening. Remember, we were demonetized. You know the story. But then the ads came back. And thank you for bearing with YouTube through the ads, Google through the ads. Hopefully they're feeding you ads that are relevant to your life and are perhaps maybe something you could click on. So how does YouTube work? Basically, when you view an ad, that's good. That's good for us. But when you click on that ad, whether it's on your phone or on the desktop, it's very good. So every click that happens on the ad, yes, the Demore family, aka the YouTube Studio Shed, gets a couple cents. And a couple cents multiplied by hundreds of people, yeah, it adds up. And over time, those pennies add up and add up. And yes, we get to receive a little bit of your generosity by viewing the ad, by clicking on the ad, and once again, I hope the ads are relevant to your life, and I know that I enjoy seeing running ads for running shoes, and anyway, just travel ads. Anyway, sometimes the ads are actually relevant to what I'm experiencing in life. You know, baby food, yeah, huh? that's going to be relevant real soon. So, all I'm saying is, thank you for watching the ads, thank you for clicking on the ads if they are relevant to your life to your story at that given time because yes we get a slice of the YouTube Google pie and and we are taking that money true love and I are taking that money that we're receiving which is pennies right now but it adds up and we are what I like to call redeploying that money pennies but it's it adds up to the shit okay so like <laughs> Thank you for clicking is what I'm getting at. Thank you for clicking on the ads if they're relevant because yes, we're taking the money and we're painting the walls and we're buying lighting and we're creating something for you that hopefully brings you a little more value. Does that make sense? Question of the day. All I know is we're here for you. We're hoping to increase the value of this YouTube channel for you in their YouTube. We love you. We're here for you. It's clean. <laughs> and I did not purchase the lights today. It's coming. It's coming. You know it is. <sighs> with that said, with that said, thank you for <laughs> being on this journey. Just thank you. Mm, mm. Seek beauty. Work hard. <laughs>